All right, so I needed to charge some lithium ion batteries, and I usually use this Tonichi Accucell 6 to charge my lithium ion batteries. But the problem with this is, as you can see here, it can only charge up to six cells. And anything more than six cells, this cannot handle it. So I need to find something else that can be able to uh, charge a uh, higher voltage lithium ion battery pack. So this is the battery pack that I need to charge. This is the Hoover board, as you can see. And the battery pack is a 10S2P. Let's see, let's show you here. See that? A 10S2P lithium ion battery pack. So it's a 10 cell in series which is 4.2 times 10 that's 42 volts and my Tonichi is not going to be able to handle that and this is where it comes in this is the solar charge controller and it can handle batteries pack battery packs up to uh, 90 volts So there's pro and cons uh, for this charger. The pros is it can handle high voltage battery packs, and the cons is that it's it's not a balanced charger. But as you can see, this battery pack does not have balance uh, cable anyway. The only cable that comes out. Is this XT60 and that's it there's no balancing on this uh, battery pack so there's no balancing on this pack anyway so it should be okay to use this even though eventually you're gonna have to do something to balance charge this battery but for now this is the way it is and it is the way it is originally designed so you're not gonna have balance just for this battery pack anyway so let's go back to this charge controller it's a solar charge controller but the beauty about this thing is you do not have to use a solar panel to charge your battery and let me show you my setup here I have hooked it up to my battery bank it is a we got two lead acid batteries, each is 12 volts, so that is in series, which is 24 volts. And then I hook it up to the, the bank. <clears throat> so the battery bank is 24 volts, you can see here. The solar input, 24.82, which is not really a solar, but from the battery. And then the output is 42 volts. And this is now charging my Hoover board battery pack. So it's charging at for, uh, you know at 42 volts max, and it's currently reaching 38.25 volts, 0.26 now. And then I set up the current only to 1.5 amp to be safe, and that is 58 watts. Alright, so this is how you set it up to charge a high voltage lithium ion battery pack with a solar charge controller without a solar panel. And also, this battery bank is also hooked up to another charge controller which was hooked up to a another solar panel to charge this bank and here it is so this charge controller is a cheap uh, PWM controller and is charging the battery bank right now you can see here the solar is flashing and it's at 24.9 volts so there are two charge controllers in this system this one here 
is charging my battery and this one here I mean this this one is charging the battery bank but this one here is charging this battery pack so the this charge controller is the power input to the battery and this charge controller is the power output to the battery bank and both charge controllers are hooked up to the same battery bank.